Well, new at 11, new vices may not come creeping in just yet to the Grand Strands Family Beach. Our Julia Richardson joins us in the studio to break down this latest development and to tell us how both locals and government officials feel about it tonight, Julia. Well, Eric and Rachel, Surfside Beach planners are seeking to block more vape shops from opening up around town until they can figure out a plan to better regulate them. Listen to this. In general, vape shops aren't typically what you think of with the family beach. Surfside Beach doesn't yet have any clear zoning rules when it comes to vape shops, with the three in town limits currently zoned as convenience stores. While those designations could change in the near future, some officials want to keep the town's image in mind. If there's anything we can do to keep the family beach safe and, and happy and healthy and keep it a vacation destination, I think within our power, in my opinion, I think we should do that. While some locals are all in favor of welcoming new places to shop, they do share leaders' desire for caution when making a decision like this. I am proud of Surfside opening up new businesses, but I am in support of regulation for it for the integrity of the town. Other residents don't see the need for more vape shops in general. I feel that three is plenty and probably more than enough. Yeah, I wouldn't want any more. Mayor Kraus himself emphasizes he has nothing against these kinds of stores and simply wants what's best and safest for his town and its citizens. It's a legal business. So we have to be careful there as well. We don't want to uh, uh, be non-business friendly. We're just going to look at what's the best way to address it in a legal fashion. It remains unclear when the Planning Commission could discuss this topic again, but I am told the town's lawyer is looking into the best way to move forward with a moratorium. Live in the studio, Julia Richardson, WMBF News.